spoil chasing on foot sucks ass, dude. <laughs> right here in front of us, dude. They're boiling right here in front of us. Give me a break on it's being tired. YouTube fishing fam, what is going on? It is your boy, Josh Exotic or STF CTF, and we're out here, a little bit different. You can see here, we're shore banging today. So, a little bit different of an in, uh, video. Actually got an intro this time. A little informative in a sense, but we're gonna be doing some shore banging today. We got uh, my uncle down there, and um, yeah, we're going for multi-species. So we're looking for bass, we're looking for striper. And uh, I kind of got like a three lure challenge. So as far as me today, personally, I'm gonna be using a topwater spook paired with a loose custom black. We got a, what is this? A medium heavy 5.7, five, 7.5. Seven, five. We got a Shimano SLS DC. And on this bad boy, I got a, um, like a punching rig setup. And then I got the loose smash combo with a, with a, uh, crank so or uh lip score bill excuse me and then this is going to be a medium heavy 610 and then the uh the slx dc combo is a full 75 as well so yeah man i don't want to waste any more time let's get to it here comes the old spook Jumping over there. It's still. Oh, I got one. Oh, I lost him. I don't know. Got him. Oh, he came off. Oh no, he didn't. I got him. Little guy. Some really little guy. What is this? What is this thing? Huh? Little baby, baby striper. I'm trying, dude. Didn't give me a whole lot to work with there. This little striper diaper, little guy. Fish number one. Come yeah, on, buddy. Beautiful. YouTube fishing fam, what's going on? Middle of the day update so i'm all wet i've been saving lures unfortunately shore banging is uh differently new to me all over again so saving lures and jumping in the water we've got one fish and i don't know where my phone is i don't know if it's in the car or if i lost it in the somewhere around here at lake mead but it might be seven o'clock right now it might be however stay tuned we're gonna start making some moves hopefully lose less lures and catch more fish that's the point. Josh Exotics out, baby. Oil chasing on foot sucks ass, dude. <laughs> a little swim bait into those boils. Oh, got him, doubles. Oh, I lost him. Do they? Oh, I got him again. Yeah, these guys are little doubles though. Cool. Oh yeah. Oh, whoa, Senorito. It's a dirty one, but yeah. Oh shit! It broke. There goes that. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I got it. 
I got it. I got the line. Why is my line? Look at look how far my line's breaking. Like, look at that. Why is that? Right here in front of us, dude. They're boiling right here in front of us. Got them. Oh. Come on, man. Hit me up. There we go. Got them. I got them that time. <laughs> So now it doesn't come back up. You're you're pretty much on it. Sure. Got him. Got him. Oh, he came off. Oh no, I got him. Oh, he came off. Oh no, he's a little guy. Literally a little guy. I know, man. I'm trying to get this off. Got him. Oh, no, another little guy. You got him or you need me to go out there? This little guy. YouTube fishing fam I believe we are gonna call it a day it's about 9 30 and uh, the shore boil banging has uh, come to an end they have not come back so we were able to land some fish my uncle caught like seven to ten I caught four or six and it wasn't a bad day um, everything we landed was on the spook everything so I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like everything we landed today was on a spook either six inch or this four inch spook um, and then, you know, we, we both have been using the uh, SLX DC rod, the, basically the combo. So we've been casting the shit out of this thing and uh, cast a country mile and you reel in the fish for a country mile. So it's been good. Not a bad day. Fish for about three to four, four hours, five hours and uh, caught, you know, about a fish an hour. It was cool to see that the fish are boiling here at Lake Mead. We are at Cotton, or excuse me, Conlon Cove. We're at Crawdad Cove and Boxcar. That's, those are the two that we were bouncing from and uh, we found the fish. So hopefully I get the boat back and then we come back and then we can get more of the fish because we won't be on the shore. So until next time, guys, we'll catch you later.